so water so clear here that you can actually yeah okay. that's a mooring ball and the line going down to right. the mooring down below yeah it's about 12 feet there uh, at low water and uh, really clear man you actually see the bottom yeah pretty cool I've, I've been seeking for the glory say 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 my name and I've been trying to wrap my own story in the search for fame so it's uh, sort of raining and uh, half sunny the weather's good uh, winds are predicted by around 11 o'clock so we are hoping to set sail by then we're just getting ready uh, we are going to dismantle our uh, newly made uh, water uh, catcher rain water harvesting that we're trying to do I'm in the spotlight not on to midnight I want somebody to hold my hand cuz I got my head in the clouds but I'm getting really scared of heights I used to spend time with all my friends but who's gonna like me if I'm not there cuz I got my head in the clouds but I'm getting really scared of heights I try to get everyone to see me. I play, play, play my games. But I just end up looking like a showcase. I have in myself to play. I'm sitting here in this empty room. Walls keep tumbling down, down. Cuz I ain't got nobody. So lonely when the day is through. It had been 25 days since we last left Port Nicola Marina, our longest so far. This 40 mile sail to our next destination was supposed to be a piece of cake. As winds were favorable and we had done this quite a few times in the last one year. So we were looking forward to reaching there by sunset and in time for some well deserved sundowners. But as luck could have it, this part of the world is known for its navigational surprises. from unlit fishing boats unmarked fishing boys and to strange floating debris and unpredictable weather malacca straits can make a seemingly calm day into a stressful experience what is that i'm seriously wondering what is that what is that so it's a driftwood with birds on it okay. <laughs> what are the things you see <laughs> what it's a driftwood with birds see what do you that what is that thing the traveling on it man yeah they're like <laughs> where are they even going ha <laughs> huh? did you see that fishing stakes like these extend all around the western coast of malaysia these poles mark fishing nets or pots and they are rarely lit at night So we've just realized that there's a net that has got caught in the propeller. So we are just putting in our boy into the water. Gora's going down. So Gora's just going to go and try and remove it. If not, cut it. Go so carefully. All the best.
Four knot winds just before we are reaching. The winds pick up. Huh, Gaurav? Yeah. I mean, the depths are less there and uh, the channel is really narrow. But the winds are like this. I mean, whole day we've been struggling with low winds. Low winds, yeah. You know, hardly any wind, and we've been motoring and we're trying to figure out how to make it in time. And as soon as we reach when we need the winds to go down, Pick up. So much for wind prediction apps. <laughs> like the while we're trying to fall the Genoa in with the crazy winds, all the ropes have got entangled, and Kia is trying to. Yes, trying. Kia did it. Kia did it. <laughs> I think. Yeah. So because we were using the winch, the Genoa hasn't got. Fold completely and it's got fold too tight. As you can see, some part of it is still open. We'll have to. Thank you very much. We'll have to Look at fall it behind again. You. My God. That looks like really menacing. Yeah. <laughs> a new place, a new home. For a while, let me feel alive. Nothing to. Hold me back, take my time, just enjoy the ride. A new man passing by, life is good, best I've ever felt. Get me up, so ending, somewhere I can find myself. Oh, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive. As I reach out, reach out, reach out, reach out to the sky, I found my way. I found my way. So we've reached the marina. We washed the boat, and now electrician yeah. Gaurav Gautam is trying to get some power to the shore supply to the boat. Yeah, tried with our earlier plug. It was not working, so we're changing the plug to Did figure you? out. The connections are loose. That's so each thing. marina has a different uh, setup. Setup, okay. Yeah, different ish. The size of the plug is different. The kind of plugs are different. Okay. And with the shore supply, we'll uh, charge so, our batteries. Yeah, batteries will be charged. We can run our AC in <laughs> harbor, and uh, power tools can be run. Okay. So these power tools can then help us do a lot of jobs. <laughs> So yeah, I'm almost done. I think I just need to fix it back and uh, wow. voila! <laughs> <laughs> good job, good job. Very happy. So that's done. Uh, it's charging. I think this is our longest sail. We've been out for 28, 25 days, I think. Yeah, we left and uh, it's been awesome. So we're in the marina for another day or two. Fill some water, charge our batteries fully, do some provisioning and then head out again before uh, Kia goes back to India. Oof.